boy KPGE, and here we are another episode right now. We are over on the Soul Trap in the making. Um, right now, I currently have 4.3 million troops. As you can see, I have uh, you know a few troops. You know, I'm slowly working on my um, Soul Trap. So f the first step that I did was to break down all the um, infirmaries, make manners, and barracks. So you can see I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven um, barracks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and nine, um, nine manners. I was about to say infirmaries. <clears throat> Get that shot out the way. All right, so now what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be spamming some troops. First, let me see. 55, so maybe I can boost this one up a little bit more. <sighs> kind of talking to myself a little bit here. But, yeah, I'm just making sure that even though I'm kind of wasting gems a little bit, I'm kind of making sure that I get the most bang for my absolute buck. You feel me? So I just wanted to bring out some content and you know everybody seems to love when I do these troop training videos so um I don't have that much wood right now even though I'm working on my um uh my lumber mills so let me up, hit that one for the upgrade one time and let me hit that <coughs> I don't think I can make any hard ox boots but it never hurts to check. It doesn't seem like I can make any hard ox boots. So, nope, I can't. So, this is what it is. This is what I'm having right now. I got my 20% um, training boost on. I'm about to open up all my resources right now. Just open everything up because I'm just going to go non-stop with spamming these troops you know um it's very important that you train your troops a certain way that um it's very i'm sorry just rearranging but it's very important that you train your troops more most of, as efficiently as you possibly can you want to get to a sound number of troops that you know is your build or your setup or whatever you call it um hi what's with this buffering is it because i moved Buffering is killing me, man. All right, so <coughs> excuse me. I've been getting sick lately, man. I don't know what is going on. But um, you want to set yourself up so that um, no matter what, you, you train troops as efficiently as you can. So um, once I train all the troops that I want to train, meaning that like I have the proper amount of troops for the the build that I'm gonna do for my solo trap. Then I'll destroy all the manors, um, and leave one barracks and make all infirmaries. So let me check it out now. Um, I'm actually going to dismiss the excess stuff that I do not need. So that's just extra might that I, that's just waste for me. Going to dismiss this stuff too. So waste the mic that I don't need. Now I'm gonna be spamming the mess out of why did it... twenty three fifty eight, okay. Oh, cause I put the hard ox hat on. Okay, alright. So as you can see, it's twenty four twenty four thousand one hundred and fifty three troops. So now, I'm going to speed these through. Whew. This, this buffering thing is killing me, though. Just bear with me, guys. You know, we about to train some troops for real. I'm going to show you how I do. You feel me? Oh, my gosh. Maybe if I reposition. Oops. Okay, so, boom. Okay, now get back to it. Train, speed up. 
So we're just going to use all our speed ups on T1 Cav. Hopefully we can get to 5 mil because that's the number I want to get to for um oh fool. Yeah, so come on. So yeah. Hopefully we can get to 5 million T T1 cavalry. Yo, this this Wi-Fi is killing me right now. I don't know what's going on, guys. But here, yeah, just bear with me. So my goal is to get to five million T1 cavalry. So I'm just gonna, you know, that's what I'm work, working on right now. And then once I get five million T1 cavalry, then I'm gonna train six million um. Six, seven million, six or seven million um T one range, and at that point my solo trap will be complete because I already have two point eight million uh T two gladiators, which is the hardest part. So this is definitely going to be interesting, and I feel like I have enough speed ups to take my cavalry to um five k. Yeah, like so. I said 5k, I mean 5 mil. The only thing is this buffering is just, is just horrendous. Um, I'm going to have to reset my router or something because it never used to do this. I never used to have the problem. I don't know if the game's lagging. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. This kingdom that I'm, not, this kingdom that I'm in right now is, is no longer a new kingdom. This is an active kingdom. They got a billion might players and stuff like that, so... It's a lot more people, and the game tends to be a lot more laggier. Like, okay, as you can see, we got the highest mice, 5 billion. So, there's a lot more people here. Wait, hold on. What was this? Kills? Damn. 3.3 3. <coughs> 3 .3 billion kills. Wow. It's going to be it's gonna be me soon. Don't worry. Be trapping everybody in a mama. Let's get back to training these troops, guys. So, so, so far we're at a million. <coughs> One million troops. One million troops, man. And, um, like, I just, what I do is I just save the speed ups for when I want to do it in bulk, you know, so that way it's just there, like, boom. One, two, three, you know, I'm ready. I'm on go. Squad, squad. Okay, let me stop. But yeah, it's, it's it's quite interesting to see because um, there's a lot of different solo trap methods that I've been seeing. I've seen people that use um T two infantry and T two cav and then T one range, and then they unlock cav feelings and all that other good stuff. And they can do either or for their front line, depending on what hits coming in. Excuse me. But I personally feel like um the traditional way with having a T two infantry front line followed by about five million um T one cav, and then six or seven million T one range, that provides the most damage because, um. T2 is a good front line and they do good do good damage, but one million think about this. One million T2 is eight million might. One million um T1 is two million might. So I could have four million might. I mean four million troops for the one million. That's way more damage. So that's just how I look at it. Everybody looks at it differently. <clears throat> Now I do believe that um depending on your setup or your lineup that the uh <clears throat> the two the T two build that some people are doing um is like it's it's I feel like when it comes to gang bangs and stuff like that it's a little bit more solid but I still prefer you know the the T one um the T two Front line and then T1 cabin range. It just 
to me, from what I've seen, what I've studied, what I've experienced, that it's just overall better, you know? So, this is going to take ages. I can tell already. I just wanted you guys to you know, see the process of how I'm doing everything, setting the build up. So, I should be able to get at, at least, I want to say at least 4 million, um, T1 Calvary. I already got my 100k seeds, so you know, everything is coming into place at this point. <coughs> um, and then, it's so my war gear, it's 77 range attack, 77 cavalry attack, infantry attack, 100%. Apply the war gear real quick. Um, I just want to see any jewels that. <coughs> uh, out of whack. So I got that green capsule right there. <coughs> so pretty much that green capsule. Okay, yeah, so I could take this out. Put in this worm jewel. It gives me more attack off the bat right there. But the um the trap is definitely coming together, guys. It's it's definitely coming together, and it should be pretty damn good. Except for this buffering, like I don't know what's good with this buffering. <coughs> Excuse me, but um everything is definitely falling into place. No stage three. So yeah, back to true training. Um, so like you, you ooh, three day speed up. I'm gonna use that. It's only two days though, but whatever. Cause I know myself, I'm gonna end up accidentally using it on um on the T1, so. Oh, snap, the hat, I gotta put the hat back on. The hard ice hat, I'm telling you, every percentage of training speed that you can get adds up drastically, guys, I'm telling you. And then you wanna make sure you're in the right talents, which I should be already. Yep, I'm in the training speed talents, so. Everything adds up, guys. And you want to go at your pace, not anybody else's. Don't let anybody else tell you what you want to do. The most important thing is you, you just be ready. Um, and just because you have speed ups doesn't mean anything because a lot of people, they'll buy tons of speed up. A lot of people buy tons of speed ups, but they won't have any resources. Like, point being, like, I can't train any range right now because I don't really have any timber. You know, I got a little bit. Could do one set right there, boom. But oh my gosh, y'all see that number? Nah, we we gotta we gotta um figure this out, bro. Nope, we're not leaving it like that. I'm not really extremely superstitious per se, but yeah, we are not leaving that. Get rid of that right now. Okay, that's better. Get this to about two, uh, two mil. And then, you know, hopefully you guys have enjoyed the video. Please uh, like, subscribe, share, um, comment. Um, tell me how you're feeling. Tell me what you want to see. Tell me what you think about the process. <coughs> yeah, so um, it shouldn't be long before this uh, solo trap is done. You know, we already castle twenty five. Um already castle twenty five. We already got the war gear. Everything's falling into place. I'm also working on a level sixty gear too. Uh let's see. Got the beast helm. I gotta make a bumblebee helm too. Um beast helm, got the the storm storm tacit. I got my firewall plate to epic already, you know. I need to get 
this up, man. I need some skull crusher is amazing. Got the frost ring gear, so great sword. So everything is definitely coming into effect and play. So you know, please stay tuned. Tell me what you, you know you guys think of the soul trap so far. Any tips or advice you guys have, I'm open to it. And let's get it popping. Let's get this content. Let's get everything flowing. Anyway, guys, this is your boy KBGE, and I'll be sure to see you on the next video. So please, please, please stay tuned, like, subscribe, and share.